10 websites you wish you knew earlier in 2020. I'm gonna share with you websites that I find are very useful for myself that I use and that I wish I knew earlier. My name is Fabio. I do videos every Tuesday and Friday about making money online and helping you become great. If you want to subscribe. So right now I'm going to hop into my computer and show you the websites I'm going to walk you through. So let's jump into my computer right now and let's see it. First website, it's called remove.bg. By the way, I'm going to leave all the links for these websites beneath the video. So this website right here, will what it will do is it will actually remove the background of any image. As you can see right here on the left, this girl, literally you click here, you upload, let's do it. So you click here, let's uh, select here an image. Uh, so right here, this image of myself, okay, I'm going to add this image right here. Uh, this and you see boom it removed the background from the image and I just can click here on download and it will literally download right away see download to my computer and then what I can do is use this image on websites on uh, whatever I do right so here here we go this is the the image cut without background and there we go. This is website number one. You can remove images, not only from pictures, but objects and anything you can think of. Pretty cool website and useful. Second website, it's actually pixabay.com. And this is showing in Portuguese, but it has in English. I like this website because to grab image where I can use on my marketing and images that are free to use, like professionally. Uh, so there's millions, over a million image and videos, high quality that you can use for free on this website for your projects. I mean, you don't have to pay. And let me give you another one as a bonus, Pexels. This is another awesome website where you can get images for free and you just can download them and uh, and use them to whatever you want and they're completely free. Right, website number three, I use this one so much, it's actually Google Photos. This is pretty cool because the good thing about this is, uh, let me scroll down, you can see on the right here, you can see the image by date. And so literally you can, you know, see see month, let's say seven, you come to month seven and you will see the image of that month. And this website is very useful because uh, the thing with it <coughs> has, I have it, the, the Google Photos on my phone and automatically it pulls all the images that I take automatically and it adds here. So the good thing about this tool is that as you save all your image here, you don't, like if you change phone, if you change computer, uh, you never lose your images. They're always here and you can, uh, you know, organize them by, uh, they already organized by date. And so you, you have everything that you're working on, it's here um, and it's ready uh, to use at any time. So it's a great backup solution, a great way to, to organize your pictures. You can also here organize by albums. Um, this tool is pretty amazing, I really like it. That's site number three. All right, site number four, it's actually this one, which is canva.com. This is, it is in Portuguese, but if you are in English, you will show in English. But this is like a, literally a, where you can edit your images. And this is very easy tool to use all online. So you don't need like Photoshop or any tool to create and edit your image. You can just go create design here. You can, let's say just a thumbnail. It shows on the right what you want. And you have here on the left, you can choose. You can even here select upload and you can just, you know, um, drag here whatever you want and you can add it here to the image uh, right uh, you can uh, you know come here to text and you can add text I mean you can do everything here very easily and then you come here to the top and just download and there you have it on your computer you can do build anything you want out of here flyers you know thumbnails uh, whatever you can think of cards you can do it in this tool, but very easy to use. Website number five that you wish you knew before. This one it's called StreamYard. I wish I really did knew this before. This website's pretty cool. Literally, you can do broadcasts from your browser, and it's very easy to use. I wish I knew this earlier. 
Literally, you can just go to broadcast, create a broadcast. You choose the channel. You, you can do it on Facebook. You can do it on YouTube. And I like you, like, if, for example, I would just go and select my for YouTube. I could just select a title, a description. I put uh, public. I can schedule uh, for later. For later, I can add the thumbnail. Let's say I would do tomorrow a live, a broadcast. I would create a broadcast. And here we go. The broadcast is here. And uh, there I would come to this. I would click here to come to the broadcast. And it's very easy. I just, you know, I could select here my cam. I come here to this place. And uh, I can do it right away from here. I can have two people. I can share my screen. I can put audio. I Man, it's such an awesome tool to, to do lives very easily and very uh, smoothly. And it's completely free, of course. Here the logo stays here on the top, but that's fine. It, it is such a great tool to do the lives. Uh, yeah, this one. Tool number six that I really recommend is this tool right here, which is called Builderall. Well, this tool, uh, I've been using this for uh, a year and a half. This is an all-in-one marketing platform. And uh, let me here go into my back office of this tool. This tool, uh, you know, I build my websites. I build my funnels. I have my blogs, my email autoresponder. I have all my emails connected here. I have my professional emails here. All my marketing tools and online presence, I use just this one tool that does everything for me. Uh, so this is a, a, a great website. I wish I really knew earlier. Website number seven is this one, the uh, VoipBuster.com. This is pretty cool website because uh, you can do calls and you can have uh, your own number and do calls all over the world very cheaply, like for cents. And some countries actually free. Most of the places you can call for free. And this tool is so awesome. And see, it's my username and my password here on top. But you can just log in and you can do calls online here on the browser. You don't need to download the tool. Very easy easy tool to use and a very affordable so like if you don't have a phone you want to do long distance calls or even if you just don't want to use a phone this this tool right here you can do calls very cheap see free calls for all of these countries right here uh yeah i use i've been using this tool for a long time ago and still use it amazing tool this the uh, the void buster website number eight you wish you knew early this website is called teamviewer.com this website is in portuguese here but when you open it, it will open in your language. This a free tool uh, that you can actually, uh, for personal use, it's free. Is uh, like if you wanna, you can install this on any computer you have, and then you can access your computer remotely online. Like if you have a computer or if you, you travel, you then you can access your computer through this through this software, and it's free to use. And even to to access any anybody's computer, let's say you're doing a call with somebody and you want to access their computer, you tell them to the, to install this tool, which is free version. You can download it for free, and then you can access their computer. It will give you a code, a special code, and then you can access the computer. You can you can control their screen if you want. You can, and it's really safe and I really very useful. Website number nine. I wish I knew earlier and, and I use this every single day, which is called docs.google.com. I really love this website. Literally all my documents, everything that I do, instead of having words, I just do everything here. It's so easy to use. And uh, let's just click here, the plus, and I have right here a document ready to go. All my notes, all my swipe files, everything that I do uh, when using a word, I just use it. This is so, use it's so useful. And also here, on, and you have here, uh, when you go to docs.google.com, you also have sheets like Excel and you also have presentations and uh, formulario. That's a pretty cool tool too here. You can capture, uh, you can do a lot of things with this. But anyway, like instead of having a, like a, a program to do all your Word stuff, this, I find it works so well. And even I track all my expenses here with Google Sheets. Uh, you can see budget right here. And last but not least, very useful website is the Google Drive. This is so awesome. Google will literally give you 15 gigabytes of storage for free online. And I save everything on my Google Drive, all my important stuff. And you can see here on my computer, I have the Google Drive installed on my computer. 
and it it, it have uh, this uh, this um, folder where uh, on my computer which is called Google Drive and then everything that I put here it stays on my Google Drive and another awesome great thing about this tool is that I can come here and I can go to preference on when you download this tool Google Drive and uh, Google, like you can select the, the folders that you want to back up let's say you have a, a folder with just music like I have right here and a folder with just all your images and uh, with all your project you can select right here and Google will do a backup for you for free online that is freaking awesome because imagine your computer explodes or it, the, the hard drive stops working and uh, all of a sudden you lose all your your work with this tool you don't lose nothing. You have everything. Your computer, my, like my computer right now can explode and anything can happen to it. And I still have everything that I need because I have all in Google Drive. So this is a very useful tool. Really good one. I really love it. And I have all my important stuff and documents and passwords on here. And there you go. These are 10 very useful websites you wish you knew early in 2020. They really are very useful for me. I really recommend them. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you unlike it, give it a thumbs down. If you know somebody that will benefit from this video, please share with them. If you like this type of content, please subscribe to my channel and make sure to hit that notification bell. And there we go. I will leave all the links for these websites beneath this video on the comments. Thank you very much for being here. It was a pleasure being with you and hopefully I will see you on my next video next Tuesday. Cheers and have an amazing day.